What's up, Smoke Goss? Phoenix, Arizona. We're gonna be at the Monarch Mother Theater on June 23rd, this Friday. You like that? Make sure to copy your tickets. We're gonna be celebrating my 25th birthday. Get your tickets in the description down below, right? Now, bitch. And if you're not gonna be there, your mom's at home. We're gonna be turning the fuck up. We're gonna have a great time. Our last event was fucking wild. The last event in Arizona was amazing. That was our first event ever. Like, ever, ever. For real, on a side note, we really, really love Arizona. Every time we go out there, it's such a great time. You guys showed mad love last time. We need the same energy again this time. So we'll see you guys, Monarch Theater, June 23rd, this Friday. Be there or be squared. I was Skoka. just gonna say that. <laughs> <laughs> Link is in the description down below, y'all. Get your tickets right now before they're out. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to a new video. What's up, you guys? Right now, it's currently 9 in the morning. I'm leaving the house because I have to meet up with Karen at her nail tech's house. I had to wake up a little later than her because me being a disorganized mother I didn't pack anything that I had to pack last night. Karen did. So she ended up going to her nail tech's house early. And I have to go to her nail tech's house too. Because as you guys can tell by the title and the thumbnail of today's video, we're doing a collab with Adam and Laudo. And for this collab, they all got their nails done. They said maybe I should get my nails done too. And me being the type of fk it person that I am, I said fk it. I told them I was pretty much down to do my nails with them for the video. I'm on my way to Starbucks right now, actually. And then we're going to the nail tech's house and then we're gonna get these nails did, you know what I'm saying? Just for today's video. I have to get them removed tomorrow morning though because we're going to Pico. Yeah, we got a pretty busy next two days or one day and a half or day and a half i don't know we're gonna be busy today and tomorrow yeah that's what we're doing right now i'm going to starbucks uh i'll pick you guys back up as soon as i get there <laughs> one more thing if i sound congested or like nasally it's because i'm still sick me and karen just came back from laughlin and for whatever reason we came back sick as hell it's not covid we tested we got like a really bad cold i don't know why i'm i got all congested i got sore throat cough karen has a really nasty ass cough like that shit is that shit was crazy last night but yeah just want to let you guys know you ready? No. I don't know why you're smiling. <laughs> I'm nervous for whatever reason. Dude, you know, you're, I was telling her that you're not going to be able to do shit. At all, huh? At all. Because you're not used to it and then they're going to be long and then they're pointy. Good luck. You're probably going to have to drive then. I am. Because if we get pulled over and a cop sees me <laughs> with my nails done, I don't know how I'm going to feel. You're packed and everything? Well, for Pico, yeah. So I'm gonna get the same thing. Yeah. You know how Adam has a uh, rhinestones? Yeah. We're not gonna do rhinestones because then it'll take Booby here all day. So she's doing a uh, colorful theme as well. I'm nervous. <laughs> I don't know why I'm so nervous. You need to take a shit, take a shit now because you're not gonna be This guy. Yeah. Alright, guys, so she just finished my nails. They look cute. Are you ready, babe? Ew, why are you sitting like that? <laughs> I'm right now. I'm nervous. <laughs> Don't be stiff. <laughs> Don't be stiff. <laughs> Babe, this is your first time meeting us then. What do you think? What are your what are your expectations? I'm gonna feel like a bad bitch after this. You gonna, gonna be driving like this. <laughs> <laughs> the stereo <stairwell> like this. <laughs> I'm gonna be clapping my nails every time I'm talking shit. We, we literally matched Adam's inspo. I'm gonna put um, Adam's um, nails on the screen, but this is why we got what we got because we we're copying his nails. You better like this shit. Imagine he's like, bitch, why'd you copy me? All right, guys, we made it back into the car. How do you feel, babe? Show me your nails, show me your nails, show me your nails. <sighs> I feel like a hot girl right now. It's hot girl summer. Sheesh. Like that? Guys, you literally have matching nails. Who else do you know that goes to nail shops to get their nails done with their man? <laughs> I don't know nobody else. And again, for the millionth time, we got our nails um, based off of Adam's nails, which is the inspiration we went for today. It's going to be a fun-ass video. It's going to be a crazy video. This video is probably going to be long as hell, too. You ready? We actually got to go to the store because I need to get something for my congestion. How do you feel, though? I'm like did, you, did they feel like, uh, do these nails feel like what you expected nails would always feel like? or? Nah. I thought it was going to be 
be easy to like handle my phone and shit. I can barely grab my phone. And he's back, he's you grabbing everything this. like this, like, like. I don't know how you guys do this, but I give you guys props, for real. All right, let's let's get started with the day. Break your nails one through 10. A 10. And her nails glow in the dark, so. What did you say earlier? The sex tonight is gonna be crazy. Baby, you're <laughs> ugly, no. Bitch, she's been taking shots already. I'm scared. <laughs> I'm so scared. Cheers to Yolanda Saldivar. <laughs> 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 no way. And if y'all don't know what he's talking about, wait, you are talking about that, right? That's fucking good. <laughs> what? The TikTok? Will this motherfucker call me Yolanda? <laughs> no! <laughs> I'm not talking about that. <laughs> no way. No, I was not. Wait, who's Yolanda? <laughs> me. <laughs> she was like, oh, babe, I got the Selena costume. I can find you where. Babe. Babe, I just bought the costume the other day. I forgot to tell you. I can finally be Selena this year. Ooh. I know it's early, but I already bought the costume, bro. Why couldn't you be here last day? Because. You were built like Yolanda? <gasps> <laughs> That's why I thought he was like, cheers to Yolanda. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's Take a shot. Wait, low key, my ass is getting fatter. I'm getting a allergic reaction already. <laughs> <laughs> so we all decided to get our nails done before this video. We thought it was gonna be harder to eat the shrimp and shit. But so. they asked for the shrimp healed already. The fuck? Like, <laughs> they just gonna no, it's because I was on the way and I was like. If this bitch is trying to have a challenge, why would you order all your shrimp, de vein, de pull all their Bruh. hair out? Of shit, that was that was fun. Nah, it's not. It's not because we got lobster legs. So or crab legs. Sorry, oh, crab I legs. Got, um, what are they called? Crawfish too. So oh, y'all yeah. bought them. We got oysters too. No. Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> no, the rest is in the microwave. <laughs> <laughs> it's in this right. small bag. <laughs> the rest is in here. Oh, 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 shit. Shit. <laughs> Like, okay, nah, babe, we're gonna eat what Adam said right here. Like, <laughs> the chili sauce. <laughs> oh, fuck yeah. He came over here, he's like, ah, oh, bro, when we get hungry. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see the nails, though. Let's see the nails. Okay, okay, nail cam. <laughs> I'm the only one, odd, the odd one out, girl. Um, I yeah, asked, homophobic for sure. <laughs> babe, I asked Adam I'm like, just, just one time. if I take these off tomorrow, am I homophobic? He said yes. <gasps> Sorry. <laughs> I'm like, they're only doing, they're only doing this for Pride homophobic. Month, bro. <laughs> yeah, happy Pride Month. That video is going up before July 1st. <laughs> What's up, everybody? Welcome back to a new video! Woo! Very special guest. Go ahead and introduce yourself, guys. Hi, my name is Lauro. I'm like, wait, this is covering your face. <laughs> Put these bitches down. <laughs> Hi guys, my name is Laura Lopez. And um, you may have seen me on Euphoria. I'm Ashtray. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Adam. What's up? And you probably seen me from the Selena movie. I'm Ashtray. <laughs> 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 but this is Esqueleto. Woo! Alright, period. Before we start, I want to thank you guys for coming out. I know. Thank you guys for having us. Thank you guys for coming here. I know, dude. Literally, I was like. We yeah. pop their cherries. Yeah. The oh. couple cherry. Yeah. Every time we were with Adam and Lado, I end up drunk as f <gasps> every single time. Is that our reputation? <laughs> <laughs> That's our reputation. <laughs> <laughs> no, for real. No, same. Every time we're carrying Eddie, I'm like off my ass. And so then. can't wait for this video. Um, <laughs> cheers. 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 All I want to say is that we're definitely going to have chorro after this. 100%. Drinking and this sh are. Bubbles gonna be throbbing. One of the big reasons uh, I was so sad about that Coachella footage <gasps> that I lost it was because you guys were so lit in all of it. Bro. Dude, no, Karen and Eddie, fun. like all of us four were low key together, all of Coachella. It was yeah. fun. It was dope. Ooh. That was the first time that we all like hung out technically. Like, yeah, we bro. bought, we like seen each other at events and like seen each other at like club postings and all that stuff, but I feel like Coachella was. For real, one for the books. I had a lot of fun. We actually don't have anything planned for today's video, so <laughs> I think that you guys are just gonna see us take shots and eat. But that's always fun. So if you have food at so home, if you're watching this, take a shot. <laughs> Mind you, it's so hard to do sh anything with these nails. Oh yeah, so for today's video, um, did I say your 
No. That we all got our nails done because Adam got his nails done for Pride Month. And we're here to support. Whee! So we got our nails done. Inspiration. This is like a a quick inspo from his because he diamond his out. We didn't have all that. We didn't have <laughs> that day to do it. So we did a, a similar version yeah. of his. Speak be, Valentina. We're going to get off tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> I might take them off like bites of the I'm gonna keep it. Ooh, this shit hurts. No. Wait, so I have a question. Okay. It's because I saw on the site for this place, I've never been to Kicking Cajun. And it said that they have quail eggs. <clears throat> oh, yeah, they're fire too. What is a quail egg? Did you get a quag? A quag? <laughs> <laughs> No, if you would, it would kiss a guy. <laughs> <laughs> no, he needs to catch up on 
the shop first and then we can ask him. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm, 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 I'm down though. Okay. Well, I asked for him. He has this, the guy. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yeah, that. Sick of <laughs> no, but like, what's the story though? It was, uh, it was kind of like a... It was a blue moon. No, it was a... Uh, so it was like... So I used to have a really, like, close, close homie. And one time we were in the car, he was dropping... Y'all must have been real close. No, he was, <laughs> he was <laughs> dropping me off. Damn, Adam, what? That shit is big as fuck. <laughs> he was dropping me off at Karen's house. And, uh... Bitch! Karen wanted to hang out, and I was like, hey, bro, drop me off at Karen's house. She was like, all right, I got you. So we would play around. Uh, I will for a kiss. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, uh, all right, bro, I'll see you later. And I puckered my lips as if I, I wanted a kiss. But I was joking, and I had my eyes closed. Oh. And I was like, alright, boss, later. Joking. And I felt lips touch my shit. Like, I felt <laughs> lips touch my. <laughs> what was like, that? No way. I said, bro, did you really just fucking kiss me? <laughs> oh, you asked for it. What are you talking about? And he was laughing while doing it. So he was like, he did it knowing that I was, was expecting it. Yeah. Alright, well, have you guys ever kissed girls? I used to have a girlfriend before him. Mm. Oh. Oh wow! Maybe I used to only have girlfriends. Me yeah. and him, mind you, look. I feel like nobody knows this. Mm -hmm. No, me and him used to be like straight vibes. <gasps> yeah. No way. <clears throat> Thumbnail. Why did you ask me out? <laughs> <laughs> I had to stay with him. Are you serious? No, like low key. I had like a serious ass relationship with the girl that I was like about to marry and shit. Yeah. I, I came out a long time ago, but before that, I was strictly pussy. <gasps> Strictly kitty girls. <laughs> so this this must have been not that long ago. Like. Yeah, I think I had a girlfriend. The last time I had a girlfriend was like 2018, guys. Mm. And, and he's my first boyfriend. He's my really? first everything. I'm like, do you want him? <laughs> hey, congratulations. Though. I know. That's really cool. Mm, that's really nice. Y'all heard it first here, folks. Is it okay to ask what the uh, how was the coming out story? Oh yeah. Oh careful. So like I didn't even get a chance to be like, hey mom, hey dad, like I'm gay, because oh, um, I had a friend that like decided to do it for me. Like he was like, he was trying to prove a point to my dad because my dad's religious, and he was like, yo, like what if your son is gay? Like what happened with that? Like you know? Yeah. So he was trying to prove a point, like trying to see if like what my dad would say. Mm -hmm. And my dad, just complete silence in the room. Was, he was, all eyes were on me. It was so awkward. We were at church too, to top it off. Oh. At church? At church. We were at church and that that <laughs> quote unquote friend asked my dad. Yeah, it was it was it was crazy. But it was it was rough for me at the beginning and then after a while me and my dad got super close. Um, and then it was cool. It was chilling. Like right now they accept me in Adam's relationship. Like they Duh. they're very they're very accepting and oh, yeah. yeah. They would like back then, back in like twenty 2015, it wouldn't be like that though. Like he wouldn't have accepted our relationship, but now he's he's opened up. That's good. I love that. Mm -hmm. Love that. Mm -hmm. Cheers. Cheers to that. We should take another shot to that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, oh. Damn. 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 So, um, I came out because I wasn't gonna come out until like, so, okay, I don't know what the fuck I'm saying. But I'm so drunk. I came out because of like my persona online. I was like in the closet up until I was posting online. So like, like my first ever Rosa video, I was still straight to my family. Dude, can I say something really fast? Yeah. Me and Eddie love your video. We would literally say it all the time. Bitch, are those real fruit movies? <laughs> You got a little hot, right? Bitch, are they real fruit gummies? <gasps> Bitch! <laughs> it's literally all the time. Like, randomly, we'll be at the store and I'll be like, babe. And he'll be like, what? I'm like, Bitch! 
Oh, those <laughs> real fruit gummies? <laughs> <laughs> that's so cool. That is so cool. Yeah, let me keep going, keep going, keep going. Yeah, so like I wasn't, like my first ever like Rosa video that came out, I was still straight to my parents and stuff. And then I didn't know my show was gonna like get followers like that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so um, I kind of was just like not saying anything up until like I decided to like continue on to that like social media journey. Right. <clears throat> Oh, and then I... Wait, I have another question. Yeah. When you were doing that, were you still dating somebody? Uh, no. no. Okay, okay, okay. So I had broken up with my girlfriend because I was like already like in my head I knew that like that wasn't <clears throat> me. Mm -hmm. So then like I was just like living my life. Like I was just like single vibes and like, <clears throat> you know, taking it day by day type of thing. Yeah. And then, uh, uh I'm listening. <laughs> you thought I heard this story before. Mm -hmm. I kind of just kept doing Rosa. And then I came home one day, my mom was like, I saw your video. And I was like, oh. and I was scared as fuck. Cause like, I was like, but like, I still like hadn't said like, oh, I'm gay. Like mm -hmm. she just thought I was doing it. Cause like, I was just trying to be funny. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then one day I was just like, I came out to LA and I was here for like a month. I got stuck here. Cause like peak quarantine, remember like everything was like shut down. Huh? Shut down, whatever. And then I called my mom and I was like, <laughs> I was all crying. Oh, she was like, all right, like let me just tell you. She was crying, I was crying, and like I low key though to this day I haven't even told my dad like the words like I'm gay. Like I just showed up with Laura one day and I was like, hey y'all. Uh, to my dad's like side of the family, and so mm -hmm. so yeah, I was like, gonna be straight my entire life. If it wasn't up to like. The whole thing that I did on social media, I still would have been like, hey, yo, what's up, bro? What's up? Where we at? Where the bitches at, yo? No way. So I love that. Yeah. I know that for you guys. How was it starting the whole like social media thing? Was this like a plan or not? No, dude. I literally like, so I was into like, I still am, but in the beginning, I was like heavy into like glam and like, I love doing makeup. I love doing it on myself and like, all that and then um all of a sudden i was just making a video for my friends like i've always liked to like make people laugh and shit but i was just doing a video for my friends mm -hmm. and i posted it not knowing that it was even gonna like bitch i low-key honestly like back then i thought because tiktok was new as fuck i thought that tiktok was very much like <laughs> Uh-huh. Yes, ma'am. Mm -hmm. So I'll take my calls over there. <laughs> She's all my rep. <laughs> She's like, mm, don't ask that. <laughs> so I was like, I don't well, know what the fuck. The, the quail egg is good. Randy, I'm scared. It is good. Man. Just try it. it. Well, try it. Bitch, what's on your fingers? <laughs> <laughs> Bitch! <laughs> it's a shred. Uh, are those real <laughs> We're hosting in Houston next month. Like, uh, uh, shut up. Mm -hmm. Where? <laughs> oh, I was so sorry. You squirted on him? Bitch! She's like, oh, you're right. Bitch! Shaw, I'm like, let's yeah, yeah. no, uh, do more. I'm still eating all the sauce. I'm still drunk as fuck. For real, for real. I'm like, that's not a problem. I'm just kidding. I can stop when I want to. I'm just kidding. <laughs> So like, this is y'all's channel. They put out everything by y'all. Um, I don't know. Go ahead. But let me ask a question. That I'm like, my booty hole. Like that's so, like, what you know. Are you gonna be here? Go ahead. It's because I feel like y'all guys' families. Correct me if I'm wrong. Y'all's y'all's families are like two different vibes, huh? Mm -hmm. Cause your family is more like I've seen y'all's videos and like I've seen like y'all's family dynamics and stuff. You. Traditional like Mexican household mm -hmm. like yes. Yes. type of shit, and you grew up more like yeah, do whatever you want, like you know, not do whatever you want, but like laid back and like your mom was kind of just like your best friend type of thing, you know? yeah, you know. Just so like, like how was that like dilemma, or like was that even ever like a? It was never like a like a dilemma, I guess. It was never like an issue, but for sure dating her, it was like a whole new like a whole <laughs> new world. <laughs> Because y'all, because y'all like moved in together like like later down the line, just recently, right? Yeah, two years ago. Damn. But I learned about being more like a. I don't want to say we weren't family oriented, but she's super close to all of her family, yeah, yeah, yeah. all of her aunts, uncles. <laughs> she's close yeah. to a lot of her cousins. Me, I'm only close to. I can say one cousin. Oh, I see. I don't know a lot of my family. Um, 
<clears throat> it's very like close knit, like your your little name. Yeah, because we grew up in Palmdale. All of my family is in like the Valley, Mexico, and my mom never really like wanted to. Be. Keep it. Oh, sorry. <laughs> she, I'm not gonna say she didn't want to bring us around, but like she didn't want us to grow up in that environment mm -hmm. that she grew up in. Oh, because it was a, it wasn't a good environment for her. Uh -huh. So I didn't grow up in like a close family oriented environment. And when I met her, she was just like that. Like every Saturday, every Sunday, it was a family gathering. And I was like, yeah, this is new to us. This is new to me at least. That's how so, yeah, family was. That was a different like transition. I love that shit though. That's, That's so crazy. Cool. That's literally me as fuck. Yeah. I grew up like my family wasn't super like close knitted vibes. Like we were there for each other or whatever, but like when I met him and his family, they we were like always we, together. Yeah, like, it's like every guy in is like 30 people. 30 people. Well, literally, yes. and I tell him to this day, I'm like, bro, we have to go to this person's party. And he's like, well, we're busy. Like, what if we can't go? Like, they'll have a birthday next year. I'm like, ah, yeah, we can't miss it. Yeah. We cannot miss it because no, like, that's that. just how my family is. Like, yeah. I feel she bad. Me, I learned a lot. Like, I learned being like that from here. Yeah. Like, we can't miss family events. Whether Whatever we got to do, we got to go to the family event. Yeah. Mm. Would you guys ever, if you guys don't already, Start an OnlyFans? You know, I was just You're just about starting to yeah. Really? No. no. <laughs> Where are you? Where's the crab leg? Where's the crawfish? Jenny. Right here. You have to try crab leg. Here. I'm like, here. Oh, crab leg. What's up, dog? Oh, hold on. What's up? What's up, dog? Oh, you broke broken. Do get one, this fucking So, Lado got the, I had to ask this like special quest, it's called Shut Up Sauce. All right, my question, sorry. The food is getting really good. Would you guys ever start a OnlyFans? Mm. Mm, ew, that's gross. What? Sorry. Really? Mm. Oh my God. I don't think I would start one, just because, <sighs> Like family and shit, you're gonna yeah. get it. This shit's spicy. It's hot, dude. That's why I was Jenny spreading. got it. Dip it oh, in the sauce. Dip it in the sauce. Mm -hmm. Dip it in that sauce. Dip it water. Dip it. Bitch, it's hot, huh? Oh my god. I'm telling you. Try it. Try it, try it, try it, try it. Nah, I'm Dip it, dip it, dip it. Damn, it. Dude, try it for real. Is it yummy? Oh my god. No, I'm curious. This is fucking hot. <laughs> No, I wouldn't. Try mine just yes. super, super sonic, whatever. Oh, right here. <laughs> I would not make it only fans because I would get too much money off of it and I would have to pay too much in taxes. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Not just kidding. Right. No, I wouldn't. <clears throat> I wouldn't make it only fans because, like, I don't know. Well, one, I'm not the most secure bitch with myself, so I just wouldn't be able to like post shit that I would like, you know. God damn. And that shit is hot as fuck. I'm telling you. No, that shit's too hot. I'm not trying that. Like, there's I, there's right, even making Dude, I tried enjoying it, bro. Like, I told you not the first, the first, like, two I don't know. I know. I feel that shit in my ears. Bro, what? what the fuck? I'm gonna wash my hands. I can't. Help it's me. called the shut up sauce for a reason. Oh, I, would, yeah. I would really start one. You would? <laughs> yeah, I would. I would. But I can't because I don't want my mom to like. I don't want it to end up like leaking on Google somewhere, and then my mom it comes across my mom's is like Facebook account and shit. <laughs> That's like the one thing. Like I, I feel like once I know that it's on the internet, my family has access to it somehow. Even though they're not gonna like look at it, they're gonna like send. I feel like somebody will send it to them just because we're like mm -hmm. posting on social media. Like they'll find they'll find a way to send it to them. You know what I mean? And I wouldn't want that for my parents. You okay? Yeah, so if you guys really enjoyed this video, make sure to hit the like, comment. Oh, wait, hold on, I said that I'm dropping. Make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. I'm gonna link their channels in the description down below. Everything, all their social media platforms: TikTok, Instagram, Twitter, Twitter. 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 <laughs> oh, I'm drunk. Twitter. <laughs> <laughs> Only fans. Everything. <laughs> We might film a video for their channel, so if we do, go ahead and watch it on their shit, all right? Yeah, thank you guys for coming out again. You I guys, oh, thank you guys for having us. It's gonna be funny as hell. You guys <laughs> I'm like, I wanted to buy food for them, but I ate everybody's food. <laughs> <laughs>